Enter prisoner's release date. I'd retire before they let you out, Kennedy. <laughs> this is for you as well. What is it? You're a free man now. We don't read your letters any longer. Prisoner missing. Who, sir? Kennedy. Not in his cell. Kennedy? I've just released him. Are you mad? He's got another eight years to go. He was ordered for immediate release. Came down on the computer. Either this system has a major bug, or we've just lost control of the entire prison department. gentlemen, to unveil this acquisition, the trustee and guardian of our national heritage, Mr. Roger Delamere. Such a very important addition to the National Art Collection, because it is truly a revolutionary painting in its use of form and colour, its angularity... And a snip at 15 million. It's not the painting we're interested in. It's him, Roger Delamere. He deserves to be shot. The Committee of Inquiry found no evidence against him. They had the wool pulled over their eyes. The minister wants your team to find out the truth. Which is, he's been pillaging our heritage. Sorting away the booty. What, sealing paintings? As government art advisor, his job is to protect us against the vandals, not to become one himself. Uh, excuse me, Minister. Uh, I have to be somewhere else. Beckett. So far, only two prisoners have been released. But the authorities are scared that this could be the beginning of a mass exodus. Well, whoever was behind this knew exactly what they were doing. The prison staff didn't stand a chance of seeing anything was wrong. Well, who is it? Some criminal Mr Big releasing all his friends? No, I don't think so. These two prisoners have got absolutely no connection whatsoever. Check the files for yourself. This guy's Kennedy. He's an electronics expert. Bit of a roz, actually. Thank you. Since when have I been a convict? <laughs> that guy's Johns. He's much older. He's been in and out of prison over the last 30 years. Ah, oh, now this is very interesting. Whoever interfered with the prison files has left a signature. Athena. Why draw attention to yourself like that? Flamboyance. Bravado. These computer geeks, you know, have got huge egos. Well, except for Ross, of course. Unfortunately, Beckett's right. They think they're invincible, that no one can catch them. This is more than some spotty kid with a high IQ flexing his muscles. 
Find out who has seen it is and stop them before they empty the prisons. Talking of muscles, where is Ed? Personal business. Really? Oh, it sounded to me a bit more like compassionate leave. I'm sorry I'm late. Late? Are you late? Doesn't matter, not at all. I see you're still keeping yourself in shape. And so are you. Although I'm not sure you can wear those shoes on court. Oh, to hell with squash. Let's have lunch. What a great idea. I travel a lot. I wheel and deal. No change there, then. It's my clients I do the deals for. I'm an agent. I look after artists, photographers, painters. Seven days a week stuff. And all at 10%. Oh, 20%, please. <laughs> of course. So what's all this about, then? Sorry? Why did you call me? I mean, I can't believe it's because you fancied a game of squash. Yes, can I help you? Hello there. Um, could we have a white wine and soda and uh, a coffee, please, cappuccino? I wanted to see you. Thank you. Come on, you want something, Sasha? Ed! Hey, listen, I don't mind. It's great to see you. It's just you've had 10 years to pick up the phone. Why now? Well, there is something. It's not a favor for me, it's for someone else, one of my clients. Ah. Go on, then. He's setting up some installation art. I know this sounds crazy, but he wants me to borrow a helicopter. I told him to get real, and, and then I remembered that you knew about helicopters. Oh, I see. And you thought I could get you one. If it's too difficult, just say so. No, I guess I could, um, fix something up for you. I know it's a lot to ask for after so long. That's not a problem, honestly. Well, the boy's very talented, and you would be helping a struggling artist. Right. Yeah, that's settled. Any news from Channing? Uh, no. Did you expect there to be? I just wondered. Becky, you don't think I was too, um, unkind? No. You were strong. That's important. Roz? Mm hmm? I've been going through those prisoners' files again. Johns was a construction manager on various secret government projects in the 1950s and 60s. Underground nuclear bunkers, that kind of thing. Yeah, but they were decommissioned. What use could Athena have for those? I don't know. It just seemed interesting. Hey, we're not the only ones running around the prison database. <sighs> Beckett, I am not doing this. Athena, can we trace them right back to where they're sitting? Yeah, but the problem is they're not sitting anywhere. What we're looking at is automated worm code programmed and set in motion hours ago. Oh. Another prisoner on Athena's shopping list. James Flood. Lucky man. He's just had four years knocked off his sentence. Ooh, look at that. He's just been programmed for immediate release. Yeah, well, we can soon change that. There was. Don't. Jan squared it with the authorities on condition we're responsible. <laughs> Looks like Athena sent a limo for Flood. Here he comes. This is what we've got on him. James Flood, serving seven years, specializes in explosives. Twelve convictions for using remotely fired high explosives material. Hey, this guy's a genius with electronics and an explosives expert. The report from the prison psychiatrist says he's paranoid. Yeah, well, just because he's paranoid. Doesn't mean we're not out to get him. Athena. No, I'm Madeline. Congratulations, sir. Well, what's this? I didn't order any. Compliments of the management, Mr. Flood. Well, You're our millionth customer. Take it back. I don't want it. It's all right. Nothing to pay. Just put these over here. Nice bottle of champagne. Flood. Who's Athena? <laughs> <laughs>
was nothing you could do. He was our only link to Athena. Hello. It's decision time, Mr. Bellamy. I want half. Half of everything you've got hidden away, or else I'll take it all. I'm giving you one last chance, Mr. Bellamy. I don't need one last chance. Didn't you read the report? I was completely exonerated. You and I both know the report was a cover-up. Who are you? Just call me Athena and say goodbye to your private collection. Don't think you can threaten me. This is not a threat, Mr. Delamere. My preparations have started already. You can't touch me. You... Ah. Oh, will you stand still? Oh, you've got cold hands. Oh, don't be such a baby. Now, this power pack won't last long, but it's small enough not to be noticed. Let's have a look. As if Athena doesn't see through me straight away, of course. Well, I'm assuming Flood and Athena have never met. Well, so am I. Because if you ask me, this guy hasn't quite got my bone structure. Oh, please. And who has it talked about huge egos? OK, say something then. Uh, my name's Flood. James Flood. And I like blowing things up. Coming through loud and clear. <laughs> Better get you on the glasses. Wow, the picture quality's great. Well, wow, look at that. That is nice. And these are a good fit. Now, use them sparingly. They drain the battery very quickly. And they don't do much for your bone structure. <laughs> Hello? Ed, hi, where have you been? Well, it, it's kind of a long story. I, uh, I got roped into something I can't really get out of. It's, um, it's a bit of charity work. What? I, uh, well, I'm helping a struggling artist. Ed, I thought you had enough of all that with Kitty McHaig. Well, this is, this is quite different. Um, helicopters are art now, and that's okay by me. Look, I'm really sorry about tonight. We'll just, uh, we'll have to postpone it. Okay, if it's important. See ya. I'll give him compassionate leave. What do you think? Well, it's magnificent, but not yours. Oh, no, don't tell me. You haven't broken in, have you? <laughs> no, it belongs to an old friend of mine, old enough to be my father. He's been sort of a mentor to me. I've, uh, wow. I've made some calls that, oh. Thank you. Uh, the chopper shouldn't be a problem. Oh, wonderful. Now, when do you want it? Uh, tomorrow? Tomorrow? Oh, Sasha, come on, I've got to log a flight plan. I've got to take I into know, account the I'm weather. Don't worry. There's plenty of time for all that. Let's eat. Roz, there's something wrong here. This Athena's not coming. Oh, Beckett, relax. Don't be so paranoid. I've got it. Oh, great. <laughs> Alex. Hello? Mr. Flood? Who are you? Why the electronic voice? Mr. Flood, I can send you back to jail as quickly as I got you out. On the other hand, if you work with me, I can make you very rich. Beckett, just keep him talking. Come on. Oh, well, in that case, I'll work with you. My car will pick you up from the hotel in one hour. What do you want me for? Why did you bring me out of prison? You'll find out. Beckett, that's it, we've got it. The location is coming in now. The phone call came from a house belonging to a Roger Delamere. 
Roger Delamere. He's the government art advisor. Jan thinks he's been stealing national art treasures for his own private collection. But well, he's not the type to break convicts out of jail. That's it. Art. Athena was the Greek god of art. You're right, that's the link. Roz, you better pay this Delamere a visit. This, um, this is, this is really beautiful. Do you like it? Yeah. Take it. What? Take it. Oh, come on, it's got to be worth a fortune. About 20,000. <laughs> oh, well done. Sasha, please don't, honestly. Very athletic. Yeah. You still do taekwondo? Yeah, I do a bit. Mm-hmm. Oh, too. Really? Mm-hmm. Come on. Sasha, don't. Oh. Really? Oh. Scared I'm gonna show you up? Well, oh. <laughs> oh. 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 <laughs> I'd forgotten how exhausting it was being with you. Oh, I need excitement. <sighs> and is that exciting? More than you can imagine. Get out. Someone's coming. What? I'll call you. What is that? Is that an alarm? Oh. This is great. didn't know with a friend. What are you doing here? On the trail of someone who's interfering with prison records. We traced a call to Delamere. Delamere? Who the hell's Delamere? Delamere owns this house. Weren't you having dinner with him? No, I was having dinner with Sasha. Sasha? Who's she? She's... Uh, let's go inside and sort this out, shall we? So you really think Sasha is this Athena? Phone call definitely came from here. Could Sasha have made the phone call while you were here? Oh, maybe. And what about this Delamere? If this is his place, where is he? Let's split up. Honestly. You said you were doing charity work. Well, I thought I was doing someone a favor, but I'm beginning to think I was taking advantage of. I'll tell you who's been taken advantage of. Me. Alex. No. Alex. No. It's a real killer. Get an update on Beckett, will you? I can't keep Delamere's death quiet forever. You've got 24 hours. Why was he killed? For information, I assume. If Delamere's been building up a secret hoard of stolen art, it must be hidden somewhere. Sasha got to hear about it, forced Delamere to tell her of its location, and then killed him. What can you tell us about Sasha? <clears throat> Ten years ago, we, um... Well, she, she blew me out, and I never heard from her again until now. So, she turns up out of the blue, and you drop everything? Alex, it wasn't like that. All she wanted from me was a helicopter. A helicopter? Ed, go back to Sasha and pretend to go along with her plans. Frankly, Jan, right now, I don't think I ever want to see her again. Those art treasures have disappeared from major collections. They belong to the nation. With you and Beckett on the inside, we have two chances to stop Sasha and recover the art.
Mr. Flood. You must be Athena. I've been expecting you. Come in. All I can say is you look much better than you sound. I needed a crack team for a special job, so I went shopping for the best. This is John's. He knows all about our target location. I helped you build it. This is Kennedy. His speciality is electronic security systems. What do you bring to the party, then? Mr. Flood is our explosives expert. This will be your home for the next 12 hours. You may have expected something more comfortable after years inside, but be patient. Guys! I've got a fix on Athena's base and Beckett. This is yours. So, what's the job? All you need to know is that we're stealing a collection of artistic treasures. Art? Is there any money in art? Trust me. What do you want me for? I need you to build a remote detonator. Good for 100 meters. Sure. And what are we blowing up? A door. John's? It's tank-grade steel with an extra outer coating. An inch-thick molybdenum shield. Toughest door I've ever put in. And now you're going to take it out. Fine. And how long do I have? Until dawn. Ten hours. Let's get to work. Thanks, Ed. Ross, did you get that? Keep me informed. Ross? Yeah, yeah, Beckett, I'm here. Look, I'm gonna need your help. Microelectronics is your thing, not mine. Don't panic, it's a piece of cake. It's just a simple UHF transmitter and a switch. <laughs> well, that's very easy for you to say, isn't it? Came. Any trouble at the house? Nobody saw you? Why did we have to leave in such a hurry? Who were those people? My associate has some enemies. Listen, do you think you can still get that helicopter? Maybe. It's very important. What do you need it for? I told you, this artist of mine, he was really trying to sit. Sasha. You treated me like a fool once before. Don't do it again. You're up to something, aren't you? Sorry, I'm not gonna go to the authorities. You want a chopper, I'll get you a chopper. I'll fly you anywhere you want to go. But if there's money to be made, I want my share. And this isn't like you. To be honest, some of the work I do isn't exactly legal. Like I said, at these days I'm out of what I can get. Okay. Just join the club. Oh, Ros, I don't know how you do this all the time. It's so fiddly. I couldn't do any better myself. Ros, about Channing. Beckett, Channing's history. Okay. Now, you need to test that the switch is working. Ross. Well, there is something I've been meaning to say to you. Oh, Beckett, this may not be the best time. Save the battery. You're beginning to break up already. When you and Channing first got together, I must admit, I was a bit jealous. Does that surprise you? Ross. Beckett. Ross, can you hear me? Beckett, can you hear me? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's fantastic. I finally get up the courage to tell you how I feel and there's some damn technical hitch. <laughs> That's probably a good thing. Chances are you don't feel the same way about me. Roz, remember John's was in construction? OK, Beckett, you're back online. We um, lost you there for a few minutes. Yeah, I, I think we're probably just finished here. We? 
Me. And you. Well, you supplied the raw materials. Was in you. Huh. Flood, meet Ed. He's in charge of transport. Flood, Ed. Right, we've got an early start tomorrow. I suggest you get some rest. Sounds good to me. Tell me, Ed. What sort of transport? Choppers. Oh, there goes the power pack. Good luck, guys. You're on your own. So, what have we got? I've been looking at those nuclear bunkers that John's helped build. They're air-conditioned and temperature-controlled. They'd make perfect storage for an art collection. Then we'd better find them. What's the plan? We have to locate the artworks. We must get them back. What about Sasha? They want her too, Ed. Is that a problem? You still feel something for her? No, you know, I just... I feel an idiot for thinking we could pick up where we left off, you know? <laughs> People change. If it wasn't for a vindictive ex-girlfriend, I wouldn't know any money troubles. <laughs> Once bitten, twice shy, eh? <laughs> Sorry? Once bit... Well, you know, is that why you're holding back with Roz? I mean, she's not a mind reader. You've got to tell her how you feel. No, well, I just don't want to go too fast and mess things up. <laughs> don't back it too fast. If you don't hurry up, there'll be another Channing. You want me to put a word in for you? No. No. Hmm. Never mind me. What are you going to tell Alex about Sasha, eh? Hmm. Alex. If we get out of this thing alive, what am I going to say to her? Damn. OK, let's go. Come on, guys. Couldn't we test this remote control? Why wake up the neighbors? Besides, it's always a good explosive. Guarantee it'll work as you say? Sure. Bet your life on it? Course. Thank you. Uh, uh, no way. Sasha's not going to tell us where we're going until we're in the air. Well, that bunker could be anywhere within a hundred mile radius. Great. Uh, so that's cloud base at three thousand feet. Terrific. Uh, no, no, that's 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 all I need. Thank you. Just uh, checking flight conditions. No need to be so secretive. I've told the others no mobile phones. I wouldn't want them to think I was giving you preferential treatment. Sure. Flood, I forgot a bag in the workshop. Can you go and fetch it for me? Big leather bag? Can you drive? Okay, let's go. Oh, what about Flood? Oh, he won't be joining us. His job's done. Yeah, but we need him, don't we? <sighs> Not any longer. We need you, though. Get in. Habits die hard. Delamere couldn't resist cataloguing the entire hall. I wonder if there's anything left in the National Gallery. None of this must leak out. We're uh, saying he died of natural causes. 
Emphasising his loyal government services over the years? Good. Above all, make sure your people get the stuff back safely. We don't want bullet holes in the Rembrandts. Don't worry. They're right on top of things. I didn't know there was going to be killing. Turning squeamish? I thought you only looked after number one these days. Well, I do. You know, I do. I just... I draw the line at murder. Then maybe you don't belong on the team. Bail out. I'll fly. <laughs> what? I've been having lessons. Didn't I tell you? First aid kit. Becky, for once in your life, shut up. Okay, now look, Alex, you get Becky to hospital. I'm going to take care of Athena. Well, don't. Move it. Perfect detonation. Remind me to put some flowers on Flood's gravestone. Come on, guys. Let's get going.
an original feature. No, Delamere put his own state-of-the-art security in. That's why you're here, Kennedy. No problem. Jewelry, Greek sculptures, treasures from across the centuries, including Athena, our patron. How did all this stuff get here? He's just a collector, a hoarder. He'll never miss it now. Start loading up, boys. Johns, show me where the lift is. We need to get it working. Get on with it. Beckett said the bunker had a blast-proof door with a molybdenum shield. According to these specs, only two of the bunkers were fitted with a molybdenum shield door. Oh, that's perfect, so it's one of two then. Ah, but one of them was flooded in the 60s. Hardly suitable for storing artworks. I'll give you the coordinates of the other one. Great. And uh, Alex, how's Beckett doing? He'll be okay. Kennedy, I wouldn't trust her. If she got rid of Flood, she killed the guy who stole this stuff in the first place. What's to stop her from killing us? You all right? You and I seem to go back a long way. That's John's out of the picture. What are you suggesting? I'm suggesting we take the initiative. There are two of us. It's only one of her. But I've got the gun. Ed. What a disappointment. I thought you'd finally grown up. I guess I was wrong. If your idea of being grown up is thieving and killing, I think I'd rather stay a child. Thanks all the same. Then why are you here? Don't tell me you're working for the authorities. It... Okay, Kennedy. Time to make a decision. Equal split. No more reductions. Deal. Get these to the lift. So was I always just another part of the plan? Way to get a helicopter and nothing more? Not necessarily. I wanted the helicopter, but I... I was prepared to give you another chance. That just isn't an option anymore. So what now? Ten years ago, you led me on and dumped me. It's funny, isn't it? Seems now I've evened up the score. Not quite even. I've got what I want. I haven't got time for hide and seek. The old works in the lift, ready to go. I'll get the explosive. Leave it. It doesn't work without detonators. What about Ed? Turn the air pumps off. I'll either starve or suffocate.
detonator. It's funny how you can get bored with people. Can you really fly a helicopter? I'll find out soon enough. piece has been accounted for and returned. Well, there's been nothing in the media about it. Another cover-up? A face-saving exercise. That's what you do, Beckett. Save the government's blushes. And you do it very well. Roz! I'll, uh, I'll go and get a vase. So, superhero. Oh, no. Oh, sorry. Mind sorry. The bone structure. <laughs> <laughs> and how's the ego? Oh, men. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Look, Beckett, um, when you were making the remote control, you were trying to tell me something. It seemed important, but there was interference. Do you remember? Do you know that bang I took on the head must have been a lot worse than I thought? Ah, uh, <laughs> Nick. <laughs> it's personal. I was just thinking about you and Channing, and we thought we were going to lose you. Yeah, and? 
me. There is one thing I wanted to say to you. Well, what more could a patient want, eh? Chocolates, gifts, fresh fruit. Alex. Flowers? Sorry, are we interrupting something? Uh, nothing that can't wait. <laughs>